Good morning. Here are the Sanibel Island and Southwest Florida update as of January 23rd, 2023. Bailey's General Store will be completely demolished and rebuilt from the ground up. Bailey's, originally built in 1965, will be torn down within the next few weeks. The store will be rebuilt on the same site at the corner of Tarpon Bay Road and Periwinkle Way. The new Bailey's is expected to be ready in the middle of 2025. The current structure may look fine from the outside, but the inside suffered major storm surge with the insurance company deeming the structure a total loss. The demolition cost will be paid for by the state's Commercial Property Demolition Fund. Luckily, 450 of the 480 solar panels on Bailey's roof was salvageable and will be reused in the new construction. Bailey's laid off around 100 employees. The produce manager at the main store was shifted to managing the Captiva Island store, which will provide the company a limited amount of cash flow until the main store can reopen. Periwinkle Park had 20 meters re-energized last week. Most of the hurricane debris has been hauled out. 80 of the campsites in the 49ers RV area of the park now have electric, but the park is currently only open to existing residents or Sanibel Island residents. Electric should be fully restored to the entire park within the next two weeks. If you are interested in becoming a Periwinkle Park resident, they do have some trailer lots for sale. You can find the lot info at SanibelCamping.com. There is not a set date on when the park will open to tourists. As soon as they post a date, I will definitely let you know here, so feel free, feel free to subscribe to my channel. Fish of Sandcap with the United Way Gifts and Kind program will begin distributing furniture through the Hurricane Ian Point of Distribution program. The program is available to Sanibel and Captiva Island residents and workforce. As of Thursday, January 19th, Fish started distributing furnishings generous, generously donated through the United Way Gifts and Kind program to those in need on the island. Recipients must either be residents of Sanibel at or Captiva or show proof of island employment. Items for distribution Items for distribution may include mattresses, bed frames, chairs, tables, and accent furniture. Thanks for listening.